this is what we're gonna be making and um, keep watching if you're interested. So you're gonna have to divide it into 32 little tiny um, triangles. So I'm just gonna be demonstrating it for one piece. One piece of paper. You can, um, on the other one I'm going to link, he did it with a, uh, he did a bunch of pieces of paper at once, and he did like a razor, but I don't have one of those, so, and last time I did that it ended up being really jaggy, jaggedy, um, so, and I saw a advertisement for a, um, a paper cutter for gifts and it does just like a straight line in half like that or you know by scotch and I'll put a link to that in the description box as well. So okay, this is divided into two. So, so I just took that paper, the two papers that I had together and I uh, folded them. So now you have one, two, three, four. And when I make these cuts, I'm making just really, you know, I've got these big scissors. So if you are going to be using scissors, I recommend using um, big ones. So you can just make easy, just, you know, one, two cut, and then it's done. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got a few more cuts to go. So again, just folding these in half. And, um, you know, cutting these, like I said, is to your preference. You can, you know, do a whole bunch of papers at once and use a razor. Just be sure you're careful with that. Or you can use scissors. Be sure you're careful with those also. Um, Okay, so this is the last cut we're going to be making. What we're going to do is take these rectangles. I'm just going to... I'm not going to do them at the same time. Cause, sorry. I'm not going to do them at the same time because it's going to be kind of hard to cut. So you've got your little rectangle left. Just fold it. See? So now you have these tiny papers left. So you've got 32 of these tiny papers from just one sheet of paper. I'll show you how to fold them into the little triangle that you need. So that's what it should look like. I'm sorry, there should be a pocket on this side and a pocket on this side. Okay. I'm going to show you how you do it. You take one of these. Take one of these. What are you going to do? So, you see I took it and folded it like this. So now, when you open it back up, and the flaps, with the open flap facing down, and it being bent towards the inside, so you see it's bending upwards like this, and the flaps are on the bottom. 
you're going to take one corner. You're going to take one corner and fold it so that so that this lines up with the middle. So you can do the same thing to the other side. Okay. So now on the back side, it's like this. This is what should it be from the front side. You've got the two flaps here. Okay. What you're gonna do is what you're gonna do is turn it over to the back where you've got this pocket. Lay it down, and you're gonna take the outside triangle on the bottom from the two parts that you folded. See? I'm going to take those parts that I just marked and fold them inwards. And then you're going to take All this bottom part, all the bottom half. And fold it upwards, right? So this is the inside, and the back, and this is the front. It should just be like a normal triangle. And then you should still see that it's going to form two pockets when you fold it. So you folded these up. Now you're going to fold it inwards, or fold it back. So close off the back. What I'd suggest doing if, you know, speed is something that you're worried about and just getting the hang of it, is just take all your papers that you folded, just take all the, you know, the rectangles that you folded and just do the first half of the step to making the triangle which would be just fold them into the rectangle, fold them in half, and then make a pile and put it to the side. Okay, so I'm not done yet, but I'm just going to show you how to start combining them when you have all these triangles. Now I just have three. Um, so you'll notice they all have the two pockets. You're going to take the corner of one triangle and stick it into the side that it's adjacent to. So, this is just three together. As you can see, I added one here. And then this middle one has its little triangles tucked into the pockets of the other two.